my own particular history. Um, I'm, I was born in the United States, and I grew up in the United States to the age of 14. Um, and I grew up with this very clear dividing line between, which is inscribed in American society, or at least it was in the 50s and 60s when I grew up, between good and evil, uh, and between the bad guys and the good guys, between the Nazis and us, so to speak. But after I left the States, I'm, I lived in two countries that were neutral during the war. And these two countries are Ireland, where I did all of high school and I lived till I was 21, and then Argentina. And I was surprised because um, in Ireland, as you may not know, but Ireland remained neutral during uh, all of World War II. And um, people often ask me, why did the Nazis escape to Argentina? And I think the reason behind that is because there are certain societies that kind of go off center, they go awry, they, they make room for the presence of these kind of mass murderers. Now, in, when I moved from the United States, from going to school in Washington, D.C., uh, I, I started going to school at a school called St. Conlet's in, in, in Dublin. And one of my professors at St. Conlet's is this man here on the right, called Louis Foutron. He was our French teacher, uh, Foutron, um, had moved from France to, to Ireland either in the last days of the war or just after the war. And I quickly discovered, I was 14 at the time, to my amazement and to my shock that everybody in the school knew that Louis Foutron had been an SS officer, a French collaborator during the war, and had had to escape France because he had a, a, a life sentence on his head. And this is Foutron when he was an SS officer during the war. And that was my first, um, my first uh, coming up close to somebody who had been a perpetrator during the war. To me, and I talked about it with my Irish friends, it was, how could this be? How could we have, as a professor at school, somebody who we all know was an SS officer during the war? And this was because Ireland had been neutral during the war, and that helped, or at least it made Ireland a, a likely destination for Nazis, or in this case, French collaborators, who, um, who needed somewhere to go uh, after the liberation of France. 